what is the relationship between soil health and organic carbon? Soil health is a very, very simple subject to understand from farmer's perspective. A soil that supports a plant, soil that supports the growth of the crop is called good soil. And every farmer knows if he or she applies more compost to soil, the soil health always is better. What is composting to soil? The dung, the residue, the crop residue, vegetable waste, fruit waste, all of them that when decomposed, they become soil organic matter. This soil organic matter increase level in the soil leads to better soil organic carbon. Soil organic carbon, if it is an adequate quantity, that provides a good ecosystem for soil probiotics, as we discussed earlier, beneficial soil microorganisms grow well if soil organic carbon is high. Unfortunately, due to our industrial agriculture, monoculture, indiscriminate use of pesticides, indiscriminate use of chemical fertilizers, abuse of weed sites, all have resulted in depletion of soil microflora. That means the soil beneficial microorganism count and the variety has depleted drastically. Because they are depleted, we do not have today adequate number resulting in extremely low level of organic carbon. Our organic soil organic carbon now is maybe 0 0.3, 0 0.4, 0 0.5% which used to be 2, 2.5-3%. Therefore, the health of soil is determined by the quantum of soil organic carbon. It's like a pulse. If organic carbon is good, the soil ecosystem is good. Therefore, all our practices should be to increase soil organic matter by giving more organic material, more biomass, more biomass, more compost. Therefore, such practice will result in better organic matter, soil organic matter, thereby increasing soil organic carbon that will facilitate a good ecosystem for all the beneficial soil microorganisms. Thank you.